I want you to show me how to get to know someone like you, someone like you. I want you to know me, cause I know then you'll see. Hey lovelies, welcome to my channel. It's Lexi here, and I'm coming at you today with a Jeffree Star inspired makeup tutorial. I created this look right here. Um, so it goes to show that you can do so much with just a little amount of money. I mean, it's like gonna be like, I don't know, it's like 50 or 60 bucks for his palette and this whole makeup look. Dollar Tree. I'm by no means saying that this is better quality than the higher end brands, but when you're like me and you have bills to pay and you're just not balling, you have to, um, you have options, okay? You have options. I wouldn't typically use all Dollar Tree products, but drugstore makeup is totally fine and you could totally do dupes. So today is just a Jeffree Star inspired makeup tutorial. Okay sis, starting off with some white shimmery eyeshadow. I'm just going in right underneath my brow bone, making my face glow up, you know. Just do your thing girl. If you want to do it all over your eyelid, do it. I want you to see what I see in us. Something so real. Okay, so now going with the lightest gray in the little LA Colors. 12 shade palette and i'm just going in right in my crease popping that color on it's just creating a little base for my eyelid and something we could work off of okay so now going with the same palette go into that purple shade and pop that in your crease Now we're taking this hard candy palette, it's a little two shade that I found at the Dollar Tree and I'm just popping the dark gray right on the outside portion of my eye and I'm just blending that out into my crease. Alright, so now I'm just going in with some blue and I am just putting that all over the lid. All right, sissies, so now going with that green shade, it's like a green gray, and just pop that right over the blue that we just put on. Okay, so now I'm just going in and I'm blending it all out, you know, letting the look come together a bit, and then we are gonna move on to the next shade in the palette, which is this light silver, and I'm just popping that right above the blue and green that I put on my face. Oh, and now we're going in with that cheap e.l.f. concealer. And I mean, it was cheap, girls. Like, you're gonna see in a minute how quickly I ran out of that stuff. I want you to show me how to get to know Okay, so this was definitely very time consuming and it's probably because it was very cheap concealer. I'm sure higher end concealer is much better, but for me, this was taking a hot minute, guys. All right, so I'm creating like this little gradient look where it's gonna be blue on the inner corner and this dark gray on the outer corner. So I don't really know if you would call this a cut crease but it's just in the middle of my eyes, so maybe. All right, time to add that pop of color. So you could choose whatever color you want in this look, but I was just taking the blue that was in the Dollar Tree palette since I'm, all, I'm trying to keep this all just Dollar Tree items. But you're going to see that the one thing I splurged on is because I picked up the wrong color eyeliner i use my wet and wild black liner so maybe it's just me and i'm not a pro at putting on false lashes but guys honestly this was the worst ever the worst ever experience i've had with fake lashes don't buy that stuff from the dollar tree y'all Shuts the door, it's a losing game. 
All right, sissies, time to do the face. And I'm going in with this cheap e.l.f. concealer that honestly was a waste of money because I ran out of that stuff real quick. I was really scraping the sides of the tubes to be able to finish my whole face, guys. So if you guys watch my little Dollar Tree haul that I just did, I picked up this brush from Dollar Tree and it's also an e.l.f. brush. And I actually like this brush. It, it was doing an awesome job in my opinion. So now I'm just going in and just trying to kind of layer up, guys. This is really cheap, and I'm telling you that it was really hard to get that stuff out of that tube. So I'm just trying to pack on whatever I can on my face to get a better coverage. All right, so in an effort to make this face less than $10, well, it was $10, um, I went in with the same eyeshadow palette trio that I'm using for my eyebrows and to contour and honestly guys this worked out perfectly. I spent one dollar and I was able to get face powder, contour powder and you could have even used that first shade because it's shimmery for highlight guys. So here's a tip for me that I've been doing for years. Um, I don't have to use any special brush to contour my nose. I just take whatever fluffy brush I'm using, pinch the two ends of it, and create this narrow brush, which then I then contour my nose with. Something so Okay, y'all, pro tip right here. If you have a winged eyeliner brush, it works great for your eyebrows. I mean, I was really able to carve in the shape that I want. So since this is such cheap powders, I went and I got water. And water really helps, you know, pack it on better. So I was starting off with this brown from one palette, but I'm just way too dark in color. So I had to go into the other palette and I took the brown in that palette and black and i was able to mix it into the perfect eyebrow color for me So y'all, I don't typically use blush, but for the sake of this video, I did use blush today for the full face look, and I hated it. I just hate blush on my face. I think it looks awful, but I just went with it, guys. So now I'm just going to show you guys that you guys totally have options, and you didn't have to use any highlighter from the Dollar Tree. You didn't have to buy it. You could have made this look for $9 and used one of those eyeshadow palettes that probably would have even done a better job. So the brush wasn't working out for me, so I just went in right in with my finger and I just blended it out onto my nose and just the parts of the face that you want to highlight. Alright girls, so this look was not complete without doing some lips, but your girl did not end up liking this color. So you're going to see me blot that stuff off. Um, this color was actually... Elf number 7702 and it's called Classy and I feel like some girls can totally pull, pull that lipstick off but it was just not for me so what I ended up doing was I took some silver and some white from the 12 panel eyeshadow and I popped that stuff right in the middle of my lips
Okay, loves, so we're coming to the end of this look now, and now I'm just popping in some purple from the same palette right onto the four corners of my lips, and that is the look. I want you to show me. So now I'm going in with the Wings eyeliner brush again, and I'm taking the blue that we used on the inner corner of my eye, and I'm taking the silver that I used above my crease, and I'm just blending them right below my waterline. Alright, now I'm just taking the white from the Hard Candy palette, and I'm popping a little bit something inside the inner corners of my eyes. I don't know, is that what you call it? The little, the little inner parts of your eyes? okay guys thank you guys so much for watching today i hope you enjoyed this video i hope this helped you guys and showed you guys that you can create a look for cheap thank you guys so much for watching and as always please stay safe and take care <laughs>